so still hoping that uh, these kids pick up a victory in this ball game as Newton takes it and he's up over the 30 yard line. Oh. Second and seven. This is Newton now back to pass. He's three for three. Make it four for four. This one's complete. And it's Cobb up near the 50 yard line. So Randall Cobb pulls in his 80th catch of the season. Picks up 18 this time. Yeah, Cobb did a nice job of coming across the field from left to right. A linebacker is going to be running with him. That's Max Gruder. He trips in the middle of the football field, and that's all number 18 needs to gain that separation. He's responded this season. And another first down out of the eye formation now. Newton four for four, four different receivers looking for five for five, and this one's almost picked up. Four wideouts for Morgan over the middle, and this one is dropped. It should have been another completed ball, and deep end for Kentucky. And uh, this is going to be Cobb inside the five-yard line. Up over the uh, 20 to about. And see what 18 can do on special teams. Kevin Harper with the kick. Cobb inside the five-yard line. Cobb finds a crease over the 30. Still on his feet. 40. Dropped at the 42. Cobb with one. Wildcats go back to work. Completed ball. And the backup over the 40 yard line. Look at the running back out of the backfield. They, they love to go to him here. Four receivers and good coverage uh, that time. And a 13 3 lead. Kevin Harper, the sophomore of mentor, drills it. And this is Cobb again back at the five yard line. Again, Cobb. Works his way to the sideline. Gets. They have the football, trying to take that fight. They're in the wild Cobb, and Cobb hits that middle of the line up over. Newton fires, and this one's almost picked off. Don just from the middle of the season on, you could see his progression and his confidence grow. Hutchins, Cobb awaits inside the 25. <laughs> And he's going down just over the 25 yard. Cobb's hands and Chris Matthews, a big time receiver. Matthews with one catch. Here's Cobb now. He's got some running room. And he's going to be tripped up just over the 45 yard line. And Andrew Taglianetti makes the tackle. And he was building up some steam very quickly. Well, you hit on a key point, Mike. I think you have to get the football to Randall Cobb and Derek Locke in this second half because in space, these are the guys that can create a mismatch, especially underneath in the coverage against the linebacking core of the Panthers. You can see it's a very easy throw right in front of you. Good throwing lanes and put that football out in front and you're going to out race guys underneath. So you have Newton. There's Cobb. Good coverage. And it's in 22 seconds off the clock. This one's complete. Top of your screen. Nice move by Cobb. To avoid the rest of the afternoon, though. Third drop for Kentucky. Here we go, the reverse. And there it is, Cobb inside the five. Close to the touchdown. He's not going to get in. But we do. Play stands. And Kentucky will be knocking on the door. A huge hit by Andrew Taglianetti right around the three-round conversion by Tino Sinceri to his tight end Mike Cruz to keep that last drive alive. Harper's kick. And it's going to be taken by Cobb. And Cobb weaves his way through traffic all the way up to third punts. Hutchins, number one in the Big East this year, gets it off. And Cobb will get it to inside the 20-yard line. His long of a 50-yard return this year with one touchdown.